Hey child and welcome back to my channel. Honey, I, I listen, I'm just to tell you this. This video really threw me for a loop and I'm gonna tell you why. Number one, this is a wig. Number two, this is a V part wig. Number three, not an ounce of my hair is out except for the part right here. Let, let, cut, come here, Saints. There is zero leave out. Child, I just, listen. I, Stop touching her face. Let me tell y'all something. The number one thing about me is hi. I'm in the gym all the time. I don't never want to do my hair. So any wig that is cute, I'm gonna slap it on. But number two, me, like a lot of y'all, I really have to like really, really concentrate when it comes to clip-ins, U-parts, V-parts, all of that. Because sometimes the leave out don't be blending like it's supposed to blend. And so right now, all over TikTok, all over the interwebs, I've seen the girls do U-parts and V-part installs without having a single strand of leave out the person that i am crediting that i saw it from was miss naturally mary y'all know what content creators we got to go ahead and shout each other out i don't know if she originated it but that's who i saw do it and so i decided i wanted to try that when i got the opportunity to do this install with curls curls they are top two and they are not number two when it comes to curly hair units they are a long time part of my channel so anytime i get the chance to work with them i'm absolutely gonna do it so they sent me this beautiful human hair v pour wig and I figured now was the time for me to jump on the trend to see if the girls was lying or was it a really good install method and spoiler alert it is actually good so if you are somebody that's looking for protect style you ain't trying to do your hair to something you just trying to be outside honey let me get you to the streets faster in this video I'm gonna show you how I got this method tell you all about this hair and honey <laughs> we serving the girls okay we serving the girls but before we get into the trickery of trying this method and installing our units let me say first of all shout out to curls curls for sponsoring this video because y'all know what sponsorships I get. Donations, donations, gifts. Now, let's install this hair. Oh, one thing though, before I get started, I do want to say I should have done a side part because of some hair loss. Y'all know I had a baby. Loving her life, but baby, he snatched me ball in more ways than one. My edges left the chat. This patch in the top of my head left the chat. But then I found out later on there's a patch of hair that came out right here it's growing back but it's a little thinny on it right there so if you see it no you don't all right let's get to installing all right let's get into this install so again this is curls curls they sent me a curly v part unit it's a naturally curly wig i got 16 inch usually i like hook alone legs but you know we're gonna rock out with the 16 so that's what it looked like out the package um it has combs on the side to help you attach it they got the little combs at the top um as well as an adjustable strap in the back so my install method number one boom we got to wash this hair it didn't come stinky or nothing but with me i find that curly hair does a lot better if you wash and condition it first so this is what it looks like once it has been cleansed and conditioned so let's get into the install so um because of the method i'm using i find that you need to get any tangles out any matting so i take a wide tooth comb just to make sure that uh there's no knots or anything so that i can completely apply this you're gonna need a latch hook and it'll make sense later on in the video so number one i'm gonna go around the perimeter of my head with the comb attachments and attach it especially in the back and then along the part that i'm gonna have usually you would have braids right there but again because of that hair loss situation that i found out about i didn't want to do braids so i just did a slick down honey uh, so just go around your part and do the combs so that it can have a real good anchor because honey the last thing you need is the wind blowing off so y'all y'all see how my baby did me just like motherhood is a beautiful thing but baby the sacrifices including your hair so anyway this is so easy even a kid could do a child so you just want to take your latch hook put it in there put the hair inside of the hook close the hook and pull it through like go around the entire part and do that like seriously I, I, I really can't even make this video 10 minutes if I wanted to just for watch time I'm telling you it's that easy as long as you have a really good human hair unit honey don't do this with no synthetical so that's why curls curls went ahead and hooked me up I'm gonna zoom in later on so you can see it but seriously go to the part you want to install your latch hook put the hair inside of it close the hook and pull it through and you want to be as close together as you can um, around the part just to make sure there's no gaps but yeah just go around the entire perimeter right there on the side like you use the comb attachment for the sides as far as like around your ears and stuff but where this part is all you want to do is use that latch hook and do the crochet method and when I saw it I was like that just seems so easy but like literally it is so this is me zooming it in um, once again I just insert my latch hook is this a crochet or a latch hook whatever child you know what I mean 
insert it put the hair in there close it in and pull it through now you could just like what actually let me stop talking i wanted to show you this is what it looks like with one half done and the other half not nah, i just wanted to bring that in so yeah just go around the entire part and do that method and once it's done go ahead and do your styling you can either do gel or a mousse because again this is human curly hair if you want more volume do the mousse which is what i wanted especially because of the part and i wanted to make sure i had a lot of uh volume but if you want more definition go ahead and do gel so i'm gonna go around the entire head put some mousse in there just to make sure i get the curls popping and like seriously it's literally that easy it takes less than 10 minutes to install this honey just put on the wig do the crochet around the part like seriously that's it like that's it <laughs> so like i said i saw this on tiktok and it just seemed so easy to do and literally it was very easy like it's just as easy as it look it's not time consuming at all a beginner can do it like the method is super super easy so if you're looking for something so where you don't have to do any blending but you also don't want to do any lace no glue this is honestly the best uh, alternative for that and i do want to say about the actual unit itself yes it is 100 human hair once i washed it and everything the shed hair was very minimal this is a very well constructed unit um it is very soft to the touch especially once you condition it is really really nice as well um um, as far as the price point they are pretty affordable it starts around 135 dollars um and they do say that it can be dyed and straightened i'm gonna be honest with you chief i ain't doing none of that all right i, I need my curly hair as the unit's last i'm gonna do as less tension stressing it out as i possibly can so once i get a unit like this it's gonna stay like this so if you're looking for a really good protective style it's literally like, like honey we're at the end of this video like i don't have the ability to stretch this out longer because it's literally that easy to do so make sure you click the link in my description box there's a code i believe it's code fake you can save five dollars off and even outside of this texture curls curls has some amazing hair they have a uh, great lace as well as clip-ins like i've used some really dope stuff child y'all know i was the headband wig queen i need to give me another one of them because the gym <sighs> that hair don't be lasting baby i need my i need my wigs so yeah honestly this hair is amazing i really do love the style um they do have all different patterns and length and it's uh, I, I wish I could stretch this to a 15 minute long video. I, I, yeah, I wish I could. Y'all know I get paid for watch time, but I, I don't have nothing else for you to watch, right? Literally just clip it on there, do your little crochet. So, with that being said, I, I, I wish I Now it's time to say goodbye to all I got for me. That's it. So, shout out to Curls Curls for sponsoring this video. Shout out to y'all for watching. If y'all have any questions, leave them down below. I love y'all. Maki, ta da. And I'm out this piece. Bye. Happy protect the style season, y'all. Don't have too much fun in them streets. Because <laughs> that's what I'm going to do. Bye. Fuchsia fake here. First of all, I'm tired. All right? I'm tired. Secondly, um, I was editing and I realized some people might have a question on how to remove the actual unit. And so basically, I'm going to show you a little bit. I'm not going to take it off because real talk, I'm leaving this wig on. But anyway, um, I wanted to show you just in case you had a question. So what you want to do is have a red tail comb and go to the part and feel for the knot. So I have a knot right there. Insert your red tail comb. And just pull this through so the more and more you pull at the loop the hair is going to actually come out so just make sure when you're doing this the hair is detangled so it won't oh lord get back in position child I'll play your role formation all right this child listen we got to keep that on but anyway feel for the loop use your rat tail comb put it inside of the loop and pull it through but before you do that make sure the hair is really really moisturized and detangled because the last thing you do want to do is like cause a human hair wig to be destroyed so yes maybe spray down your wig with some water and leave-in conditioner all right i love you i'm going to bed bye